Well, good afternoon, champions. Good to see all of you here today. And uh, before we go on with our service today, we want to release and dismiss the children. And so we're going to have a time of prayer, and let's uh, pray with them. And so one of them will be praying. sons and daughters uh, of God and coming together and breaking bread together, remembering what the Lord Jesus Christ has done for us. And so we know that we are serving a living God. Jesus Christ is alive. Amen? Amen. But we remember what He has done on the cross, that He died for us, for our sins. And so the, 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 uh, the juice or the wine represents uh, the blood of Jesus Christ that was shed for our sins so that we can have forgiveness of our sins. And of course, the bread represents the body of Jesus that was nailed to the cross so that you and I can have eternal life and that we can have forgiveness of our sins. So we thank the Lord for what He has done for us. And so today we're going to have communion together. So if you recognize what Jesus Christ has done for you, and you are welcome to participate and be a part of of this communion together all right so we're gonna call the ushers to come and distribute the emblems while we're doing this i would like you to just go before the lord and begin to just think about your your life and examine your life before you partake of this and if there's anything in your heart that you need to surrender to god you surrender it at this time amen and we're gonna have a time of worship as we're distributing the emblems god bless you let's have a time of worship Yes. 
Bible says that when the night before Jesus was betrayed, he took the bread and he broke it and said, this is my body which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. So today, we remember what he had done for us. We remember that his body was nailed to the cross. He took all the iniquities and infirmities upon his body and nailed it to the cross. Today we're free because of what he's done for us. So let's pray for the Hallelujah. Lord, we do not take these things lightly, Father. We just want to honor you and thank you today, Lord, for this privilege, Lord, that we'll be able to partake, Lord, of this communion and we thank you for your body, Lord. It has been bruised, Lord, for the healing, Lord. Your people, Lord, we really want to thank you, Lord, for such miracle, O oh God. And Lord, you are also the bread of life that came down from heaven, Lord. And whoever partakes of you, Lord, will have eternal life. And today, Lord, as we receive you and take this bread, O oh God, that symbolizes your body, Lord, we remember what you have done. We are filled with awe and greatness and thanksgiving and praises, Lord. For truly, Lord, without your sacrifice, Lord, we wouldn't be here and we will not be able to attain salvation, Lord, in eternal life. For this, Lord, we are truly grateful. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let's eat the bread together. After supper, he took the cup. After giving thanks, he said, This is my blood, the blood of the new covenant. It will be shed for you, for all men. That sins will be forgiven. So today, we're just thankful for the new covenant that Jesus has set. And upon that cross, he was the ultimate sacrifice that you and I can receive forgiveness. In his blood, there is salvation. In his blood, there is deliverance. In his blood, there's freedom and forgiveness. So today, let's thank Him for what He has done for us. That sacrifice. Let's pray for this uh, wine. As we remember, Lord, as we remember, Lord, Your sacrifice a thousand years ago, we also remember Your love, Your picture, and love towards us, Lord. And Father, thank You for giving us Your Son, Lord, for shedding His blood, that provides us purification, sanctification, and redemption. And because of your blood, Lord Jesus, we have hope. We have the freedom. We are reconciled with you. And we have the boldness to approach your throne of you. Thank you for your blood, Lord Jesus. Amen. That's true. Praise God. Let's have a time of worship. Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Thank you so much. 